the layer slider is the tab on the left in WordPress that says layer slider WP and when you click on that it'll take you to the list of the sliders that are currently on the site or um, are created but not all of them are on the site so to make changes let's say we want to make changes to the home page slider we would just click on home page slider and to check on where that slider is located like to make sure that this is the correct one on the home page you would go to your pages and you would find to make sure that it is on the home page you would find the home page and you would go into that and there will be a code either at the top in the content so right here it'll say layer slider home page slider 5 and then we would go back to our li uh, list of sliders home page slider 5 and then that, that'll be the right one so we'll click on that to go into it and up at the top it'll show the different slides that are in the slider and by clicking each one it'll then change the slide that um, that it is so if we go to one two and three you can see how it changes and it shows you kind of a a preview of what it what it will look like but it may not be exactly like how it is on the home page or where the slider goes out to so a couple things we can do is let's say we want to change the background image of one of the slides choose the slide and then up at the top here it'll say slide image and we just want to click on that and then we can choose that either from our media library or we can upload a new background image and then once we upload that once we upload that we find the image and then just click insert and then that'll show up behind this new slider and the slider, um, the image dimensions will be in the handbook so that you will know exactly uh, what size of images that need to be posted into the slider. And then after you have the background image fixed, if you want to make any changes to any of the content that switches in and out, you would just click on that area and then down below it'll show that layer so by default it may show this transition and you just click the content and then now you can make the changes to the text so this one we would click on that and then it, it would bring up transition by default and then you just click content and then here is the text that is displaying on that layer and that can go for different layers like on different slides you want to edit this click that click this area anywhere in there click content and then there's the text. So a lot of these have these little break codes. And what that does is you can see it says serving the L cart and then it's got break. So that tells it to go down to the next line. County community break and then it breaks it down to the third line. And you'll see these other things. These are called strong tags. This is what makes that text bold so if you wanted to change any of this other text to be bold you would put this strong tag on either side of the text like the county community you just put this strong tag at the beginning and then this strong tag at the end and this one's just slightly different it has a little uh, little uh, forward slash on it so then that tag surrounded by that font surrounded by that tag will then make it bold and then this can also be you can click and drag this anywhere like let's say you put up a new background image and the person or the main focus is in the left hand side you can then take this and drag it over to the other side and then you can save the changes and go out to the home page and make sure that it lines up correctly or it's the right way because like I said this is just kind of a simple preview it may not be exactly how um, you see it out on the, the main site. So after we have that, we have our slides, 
we've made any changes to them. Once we're done, we can just do the enter preview and that will also show us a little, uh, little simple slider like that. It will show you how it kind of works. And see this doesn't look exactly how it shows out on the site, but just kind of shows you a brief glimpse of it. So once we have um, everything we like, we click save changes. And then after that, we can then go out to the page that the slider is on and check them out and see if they're good. So that is just um, a brief tutorial on um, simple background image and um, you know different layer editing like these two are images. So if we click one, we can go down and do content and you can see the image right here and it'll say it'll show you kind of a, a preview. If we just click that, we can then choose a different image as well and then insert that to replace that image. So these can be replaced and this can also be edited by going to the content. So after that, you got everything, you updated it. Then you can also um, just kind of go through, make any transition changes. This is kind of advanced stuff, but there's transitional changes and some more advanced stuff that kind of goes along with the slider but doesn't necessarily need to be edited. And you can also add new layers. So let's say we have some text and we also want to add another block of text. We can we can duplicate this layer which is it's a lot uh, handier to just duplicate it because this has some custom styling um, CSS to it. So what the best way to do is like on the home slider or on the second slide something like this we just click on that duplicate this layer and then it'll make another one just like that and then we can go in and edit out that content and then it'll also have that what that you know the white background to it that font the way it is and it'll just be styled and it'll save a lot of time on having to custom style that again and once you're done you just click your save changes